Good night. How are, you, how are you feeling after that very long game against Valentina? Well, this is a good question. I think I'm happy because now I feel mixed. Um, first, I had um, a good position, then I ha turned it to bad position, which also had a short on time. And then I had good chances. She, something I think, miscalculated. And then I had good chances. So she um, gave me this is and I used. And after that, she blundered, which I was surprised how she could do. Uh, could blunder this is move. And then um, I had um, some simple winning uh, chances. So I just made this is long, long, long winning position. <laughs> Towards the end, I mean, you were still running very short of time, less yeah. than a minute. Yes. Were you getting nervous? Well, I think already I'm used, but um, I was nervous because I could uh, spoil the position. So yeah. I just didn't yeah. want this. Everybody else was getting nervous, by the way, including Fiona in the commentary room. Yeah. And us in here. <laughs> We're all nervous for you. <laughs> but at the end, you played quite confidently. The last 10 or 15 moves, you seem to. Yeah. Oh, that's great. Well, um, I got the impression that you when, kind of knew yeah, I all the just, right squares for the bishop. Uh, yeah, I just there played bishop f e4, which mm -hmm. I firstly wanted to play queen e4 and then just normal, simple winning. And then I just was calculating there, I don't see f3. When a ship played f3, I was like, oh my god, I didn't see this. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I'm kind of was blind there. That's the problem, isn't it? When you play a long game, you yes. can hallucinate. Yes, yes, That's exactly. That's what she was hoping for. Probably. Okay, let's have a look at the game. Okay, good night. Let's have a look, a look at a couple of positions from your game. Um, so here, I just w was thinking what to do because I'm already about to losing my pawn. I thought, first I was thinking B3 changing, then I thought, okay, let's save A4 and for some chances. So I played knight D6. Uh, which is, I think, practically maybe the best move. So this, and then this, this, which helped me just confuse my opponent. Okay. Bishop f8, played this is for just um, protecting the pawn, and mm -hmm. then rook a6, yeah. b5 I can't take because there's rook b2 and bishop b7 is hanging. Yes. I played here rook d8. Well, uh, I can't say my m moves are accurate because I'm low on time. Oh, oh. <laughs> you've done it again. Wait, okay. did, can you remember the number? Um, rook d8, there is. Wait, wait, yeah, just a bit. Oh, so difficult. Yeah. Here, here, exactly. Here, I, she played rook e5, which is good. I played this. She played rook e8, just protecting it and then here well she could I think take d4 bishop g7 and then bishop c3 but she didn't I think she wanted to play something safe and here she blundered this is rook b5 and she, her queen is trapped kind of and then what okay. if she'll go back and then oh wow of course yeah, yeah. and then even queen uh, to bishop d8 uh, here there is queen d6. If bishop goes somewhere, bishop uh, then queen b6 again. Yes. And here just I played this is I think it's bad move. I had to play a3. Okay. And uh, so she was able to take that. She pawn. used this is and played like this. Well, here actually evolution. I think it's had to be something around maybe good for right. I think. Well, I don't yeah. think it should be bad. This is queen g5. And then I played, this is for maybe some ideas, bishop h6. Well, she, here she played bishop d2. Um, I wouldn't say this is the best move. And here we're already planning some active moves. And then here she played bishop f3. Well, it's already getting too risky. Yes. And then here, bishop b3 I played. Ah, yes, and she moved her Just king. Just wanted that's... to some pin. Um, yeah. I also had some ideas if she could, let's say, 
Oh, I was thinking Kyori this is. And uh, saw it something like this. Maybe. Okay. Well, then types? it takes, then bishop h6, c2, I have. Oh, wow. Yeah, and but when she played queen d2, I, saw, I was already thinking, okay, let's play oh, yes. this move. Your trick. Let's just check if you... Oh, yeah, bishop e2, yeah. Yeah, bishop e2 just shocked me because... Self-pin, really. Yeah, isn't yeah, she helped me really here. And then lost the pair. And then here, bishop h5 played, just wanting some, some creating. And honestly, here, I can't say that best moves, what are they? Yeah. Yeah, so yeah. because there is a bunch of moves, which is winning position, I mean. And here, I think here is just normal goes. We can go switch to the position where I made this is error. Yeah, here. I mean, this is a position I was thinking, okay, let's play this into this. I'm taking. Yes. Actually, yes. maybe here also yeah. same. I think Veselin was saying, Veselin Topala was saying, should take the queen because otherwise it takes a long time to win. And well, I think it wins. Yeah, yeah, it but should be some win. Tricks for why. Well, I'll not so for probably as the game in as in the game, but yeah. I think here um, I don't really have to give my bishop. Well, I can act greedy. <laughs> okay. Bishop f8. Oh, oh, give me a number. Um, bishop f8 is here. Um, this 58. Yep. No. Um, so I had bishop f8, but I played this just not seeing f3. Um, which is the result of playing long hours. Yeah, yeah. This takes so long to win, doesn't it? I mean, it's winning, but it takes so many moves. Yeah, so to move, I just made a... Yeah. yeah. Then here, actually, we can switch to here, which... Queen g3. Yeah, queen g3. I just checked and then play bishop d5, yeah. just helping my queen. Then check like this. Well, here I was very nervous because I was thinking, okay, let's, if I move some bad move, the pawn will have gone. Let's say yeah. if this, and there is such. So, yeah, it's easy to, to go wrong. To play now, very it? accurate. Mm -hmm. So, not to. Okay, rook b1 was yeah. for bishop b3, and I played bishop c4, which is, I think should be one of few moves that wins. Because, oh my god, I keep doing <laughs> it. Me it tries to be crazy. Yes. Bishop c4. Yeah. Um, I don't know why it does that. So this plan is bishop e2, then d3. Yeah. Um, this and played queen h. Yep, and here it's just goes. Some a matter of technique, as they always say in the well, cliches in the book, but it's hard in real life, isn't it? Well, I thought it would be very easy, but yes, it's mm. really it's wanted done. some technique. <laughs> Back here somewhere, yeah. Okay, so here I played the rook d1, yeah. then check. And uh, well, here f5, I played bishop g4 for creating some d2, and then bishop f5 I can take. Yes, yes, that's right. And then yeah. um, initially she. Well, what is happening? <laughs> it's been happening on every game. <laughs> you don't know. So um, here, initially she lost the pawn, and. Yeah, once you won the pawn, it's still a long process. Yes, to yes. To get the bishop back. Yes, to, I had to just bishop f3 and yeah, e4. So bishop there to there, or, and you mm -hmm. eventually brought yeah, it Yeah, here the is passive. Yeah, yeah. Okay, thanks very much. Thank you.